And good morning folks, Rich is here. Today I'm going to be working on a 2016 740 Li, BMW of course. It's a CAS 4 system and what I'm going to be doing is um, not unlocking it but reading the D flash information along with the P flash just in case I'm going to need it later down the line. But right now I got to take out the bottom panel and then I'm going to go EEPROM it. So I'm going to bring you along. Alright, so this is the vehicle. Let's get to working. We got some panels down here. I'm gonna bring you guys along. I'm not gonna bring you guys along for the whole unscrewing, but let me just get this panel out and we'll get to it. Stand by. And we all know how annoying it could be to remove some of these cast modules because they're such in a weird place. But look at me with my little twisty angle. So I gotta get up here, angle it here, and just turn, turn, turn. Just have a fun time turning it to the left. And just like that, tool comes out and screw. Just this connector, these little connectors. Call it a day. Okay. Alrighty folks, let's get to e-promin. Alright. Let me go get everything set up. Get the e-prom adapter, get my VVDI, and let's get to e-promin. So time to open this up. I don't recommend you're gonna open this up. Try it with a plastic pry tool. Don't get, don't be too aggressive. You don't want to mess up any of the components that are inside. You get yourself in a big problem. This is a uh, 1N35H. Lock it down, and all the pins are good. So you, all, you just gotta line the guiding pins, and everything else will just follow. Alrighty, so I believe I checked all the pins, so everything should be good now. So let's just go ahead and read D flash, and let's begin and continue. All right. It's going to try to crack the chip. I'm going to be using that key right there. And there you go. Reading fun stuff. Save and edit. Juicy, juicy info. Say those. Seven forty LI cast for original. Okay. So now that that's done. I know people normally don't do this, but in the event something does happen to his module, I'm going to read the P flash. I know this takes a lot longer, but I'm gonna just let it run off, let it run through.
usually after cracks like trying to crack the four for the fifth time it works but there you go four so let it read do its thing reading slowly because this is where the program flash is at so it takes a long time to read that info so I'm gonna let it do its thing I'll be right back all right guys I'm back P flash is done I'm just saving that just to see if there's any info there it's a crap ton, so let me lower the volume so I don't get no copyright strike. Perfect. Okay, so clear here. I'm gonna put here 740 li. Flash original original one. It's kind of cool. Okay. Now that that's all done, we could put this baby boy back. So put this thing right. Alrighty, guys. It's back. I'm gonna be using the test platform. It's gonna be connected to the key two plus. You always know, just make sure you line this shit up right. If you don't want to see your module going to smokes. So now that I got the module on the test bench, I'm gonna go check. Got 13 volts here. I'm gonna check if this right here turned on the dash light. And as you can see, it simulates the dash, so it does come on. I'm turning it off, let remove this. Try to hit it again nothing so the purpose of today will be to now that I have that on come over here let's go to auto diagnose yep. tech cast 4 plus so we're gonna generate keys with the EEPROM Right here. All right. I'm gonna make a dealer key, and this is gonna be a where was it? Okay, one N three five H. Load the EPROM dump. So that was from Prague for today, which was this backup with D flash. Okay. So fun stuff. And we're gonna go to uh, let's say position number eight, why not? I do have a working key. So have a working key, insert working key into programmer and continue. My working key. Keep this in my hand. Do it it's reading data okay so now what I'll do is I'll take a picture of this because the ISN is at the bottom very important very crucial when you're doing these type of cars so now that that's done it says prepare the dealer key it needs about 30 seconds so take away this key we're gonna put the new key and let it start programming key is written successfully don't need to write it back into the EEPROM okay because I already did the job we already wrote it with the EEPROM info so what we're gonna do is make sure that this key works so we're gonna turn off the dash light let it be off as you can see right now nothing turns on so we're gonna put this key into the slot and we're gonna tell the car to learn it and there you go the car is already good to go so we're gonna put back okay, give it a second there you go all set so now we're going to put everything back into the car and collect our money and I'm basically done putting this all back together this last side trim right here Back. Right. 
get it. Let's go cut this key. Call it a day. All right, guys. BMW 740Li 